All right, done for the chart of account. Now I'm going to show you how to import customer master file. If you no need import chart of account, then you may create a new database. So this is the template of Excel for customer master file. Before we import customer master file, please import those master file for area, agent, terms, currency first. For example, now you can see the list have an area, have an area code. So I can just copy over the column of the area code and insert into a new sheet and paste it. As you can see from the list, there is many duplicate area code like Malacca, there is two record, Kuala Lumpur, there is three record and so on. So we have to filter it. You just highlight the column, then go to data and look for advanced. Then tick on the unique record only and press on OK. So system will be automatic filter those record is unique. You can just copy and then paste it into a new sheet and rename it to area. Okay, now I will guide you some of the formula in Excel to avoid error messages to appear when you import. So, for example, trim. The function of trim is to remove spacing on last character. Last character. So you just have to point on the column next to the area code, then put in equal sign, type trim and open bracket highlight click on the column that you want to set this formula and close bracket enter so the result will be come out if you want to apply this result to the rest of the column you just highlight the column with formula and it will come out the plus sign you just drag down will do so all the result it will automatically come out so now we have to use another feature called truncate. The function of truncate is to short the number of character. For example, area is only entitled for 10 digit character. So we can use the truncate option in Excel for area code do not more than 10 character. So same thing, point on the column, put in my equal sign. Then type left, open bracket, point on the column that you want to filter. And this is a 10 digit character. Then you press on close bracket, enter. So same thing, you can, if you want to apply to the next of the column, just drag down will do. And as per you can see from the screen, the Kuala Lumpur will become K-U-A-L-A. L U M P. If your automatic shot is only 10 digit character, let's rename the column. For example, here I want to put in area done. So when you import the time, make sure you capture this area done column. Mm. Let's go to the import now. You just have to go to tools, maintain area, same thing, get file and find out the Excel file. Then look for the area, get data. So you are, see, you are able to see the area done just now. You just drag to the code. And if you want to apply the area done column to the description as well, just drag it into the description. Then just post to account until it come out record successfully post to database you click ok so done for the area agent terms currency master file let us go to the customer master file you just have to go to the customer maintain customer same thing get data and find out the excel file and look for the customer column 
get data so map all the field for example company code you just drop in and drop to the code company name company name too okay before you start for the address have to be careful for the if you want to import for the address and the rest of the information can you see the bottom part there Go the new button please click on the new button then only you pull the address one to the address one column drag and draw for the address two three four attention phone fax and email together with the rest of the info then then please click on the save button if the customer have more than one delivery address and now you want to import for the second delivery address please click on the new again and then map over the delivery address delivery address one two three four okay please be careful for the branch name cannot leave it building you can choose either empty it or type delivery and go to save it so after done map all the field then after you map all the field let's say if you don't want to import all the record from the system, from the excel you just want to import the record maybe start from 2 to 10 then you can just click on the record then set up 2 to 10 or else if you untick it you will start from the beginning until the end of the record so after maybe if you just import halfway for the previous time and now you want to recall back redo back the setting you can choose right click save setting and next time if you want to recall back for the same excel you can just load the setting will do so now let us click on the post to account until it come out record successfully post to database then you click ok so now we go back to the database and you are able to see all the customer master file when you double click in all the delivery address info will be imported into the system then you just repeat the same step at the supplier maintain supplier